Problem number 14, we are told that a total of 50 juniors and seniors were given a mathematics test. 35 juniors obtained a score of 80. So we have 35 juniors times 80. And 15 seniors obtained a score of 70. So we have 15 times 70. What is the average score of all 50 students? So the average score of all 50 students is the sum of all the scores. Well, I had 35 students that were juniors, and they all had 80s. And then I have 15 seniors who obtained an average of 70. So I had 50 students total. Wait, wait, wait. 50 juniors and seniors. Yep, 50, because 35 plus 15 is 50. So now I just got to multiply all this up and divide it by 50 and see what I get. So I'm going to write this over to the side. 35 times 80. I'll multiply everything by 0. And then 8 times this is 40. 2,800 for that one. Then for this one over here, if I say 15 times 70, I'm going to multiply everything by 0. Now I'm in the tens place. 7 times 5 is 35. 7 times 1 is 7, plus 3 is 10. So I've got 2,800 plus 1,050 divided by 50. So if I add those up, I've got 3,850 divided by 50. Uh-oh, put your thinking caps on. We're going to have to do some long division. 3,850 divided by 50 it's not that hard. 50 goes into 3 zero times. 50 goes into 38 zero times. 50 goes into 385, I would guess, seven times. Seven times zero is zero. Seven times five is 35. Subtract and find the difference. Five and three. Hey, if I drop my zero, guess what? 50 goes into 350 exactly seven times. So my answer is way up here, 77 is the average test score. No calculators. <laughs>